Hello again, welcome back for another daily Barnabizer with Pet Ends. It is still October 29, 2024. Well, it looks like I got my backlogs up to two weeks now. As of the last video, I think. Cool. See it here is L L D Y W G Z T. No numbers, huh? What the fuck is this? Alright, that's a little better. We got a missing poster, though. That's actually huge. So if we die, we become the last. Lol. Look at that item. What the fuck? I can't get charges, huh? All right. The first room with enemies. Enemy spotted. Oh, I have I have nachos. That's right. I got nacho thunder thighs. Don't step on that. Your thunder thighs are in, can't handle the bombs. The bombage. I wish I could destroy spider webs on the floor. You know, that's got some freaking grip to it. One the last daily. So nice. So cool. Okay. These stats are better since we rerolled them. <laughs> As we should have. It's rare I get this, like, D100. Like, I don't normally see this thing, like, out on the wheelbie. Out in the opening. He's two. Oh, shout out to that item I got from I I I, I uh, yeah I got in the daily, which it kind of helped in a way. I don't know. I've got enough coins. No, I do not. I am broke by a freaking penny. Rest in pizza. That cigarette room too is a little spicy. I think it's like up there next to that uh, uh, shop or whatever. Oh, shit. I might die. <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. All right. We're playing as a lost now. It's been a hot while since I've played the lost on a non-daily. Uh, all right. Well, shit happens, I guess. Now we got to be extra fucking careful. Okay, yeah. Especially that shit. Extra fucking careful. Funny. <laughs> he made farty noises. Well, I guess we take chewed pen, huh? It's a leaking. Okay, but it's leaking. It's been a while since I've played the last. Outside of the daylight, it's been a while. Fuck the speed, man. It's like fucking flying a damn cargo plane full of like Lamborghinis and shit, and you're trying to like take off from a dis disaster zone in Vegas. Oh, yeah. I referenced that damn movie. Two 2012 or whatever it was called. Yeah, he went there. Uh, I'm gonna... Uh, fuck, I need the bombs. Like, that thing is good, too, but... Bombs are a necessity. Now, since I died and became the lost, did that fix my stats? Except my speed, of course. I think it did. I think my tears rate was still kind of ass and the damage too. A lot of damage wasn't ass, but it was like in the fours. I know that. Okay. Oh, it's lost. We're going to go for devil deals because like that's how you do it. Range up. Sure. Oh, I'm not brave. <laughs> Got all last runs. I could re- Well, it probably wouldn't hurt the reroll, right? Like, really think about it. Like, I mean, Thunder Thighs, it's good for, like, cracking rocks. But if I need to, like, hide over shit and stuff, I don't want to, like, 
die or something. I'm gonna crack this room release first here before I reveal. Well, oh, I should go in the item room too, I guess. See if it's worth a hoot. Okay. Oh shit. Oh shit! I forgot I could do that. Alright. Um. You know, let's take it. It's a range down. Oh god. Yeah, I should. I should have thought. I should have thought. Forgot the finger, so it, that can help us. <laughs> this is ass. What did I do that for? I'm gonna have to re-roll again. I can't. I can't. This is like one of the worst range ups I've ever had in my entire life. I don't know if I had range worse than this. So we're gonna leave that box there. Well, let's touch it here because I don't want to use it because I think it'll give me like soul hearts or keys or something. But I want to have that there so I can try to re-roll it. If I'm so graciously have enough soul hearts, and it's soul hearts, but uh. charges here, which we might not. Unless we get, like, a Krampus of the first floor, which I think is highly unlikely. Alright, let's go back to the curse room. Careful here, Harry. Glad I got that. Alright. We're gonna have to go in here and fight. Hold on your asses. All right, it's not a terrible boss. We just got to watch out for his bullshit stuff there. Give it him the piss. Piss off! Now, Ronald Weasley, you're not supposed to be saying that to Harry. He's the fucking chosen one, and you're just a bratty little shit. All right. I could take the quarter. Wait, was there anything in the shop that was worth the damn? No, I already bought something in the shop, didn't I? Uh, I'm going to say maybe Horror Babylon. I wish that would give me a range. Oh, you got to look up with the health up. <laughs> Practically fucking nothing. Oh, there's a battery. What the hell's wrong with me? All right. Fanny pack. That's hilarious. I'll take it, I guess. It's a better setup. The range is better. Yeah, I got a damage down. So what? Like, I'm fine now. For now. Unless I screw something up. You know I'm going to find a way to screw things up. Don't you worry. I'll find a way to self-sabotage this run. It's in my blood. Sucked blood. Bleh. All right. My stats really that low, though, despite having those items? Must have really messed up my stats. Oh, my lord. If we didn't have... a Ouija board and... this... Scythe tears, like, our damage and tears would have been ass. Oh, of course, we have that one item. Where it's like, oh yeah, speed down, but you're going to get a slow speed up, and then when it gets to two, you're going to have invincibility that's going to be annoying. Have fun. Now, rinse and repeat. Do I even reroll at this point? I think maybe I should. No, I do have two damage up, so it's like... This is this is bullshit right here. The build. I can't stand it no more. Oh shit! Oh, we got brimstone and everything out. All right, perfect. 
We're done. We're done re-rolling. Finally. After 10,000 years, I'm free. It's time to conquer Earth. Or Isaac's floor. Isaac's basement. Or free. That would have been funny if that was a magic mush there. I'm not that lucky. I'm never that lucky. Yeah, this is cool. I guess we'll get Spewer. It doesn't really negatively affect me, so... Oh, now he's all angry. Now he will affect me indeed, but... Put his old, big old angry face on me. Secret room. Ten points to Gryffindor. Harry, you can commit all kinds of murder and atrocities in the school of Hogwarts. But I promise you, Harry... You will never, never lose the house count. As long as I, sh as I shall live. Well, that's a little spooky, Dumbledore. Why would you even encourage atrocities of other students? Well, you see, Harry, I hate the Slytherins and the Hufflepuffs. Just keep it between you and me, all right? No sons of bitches. They were always fighting and causing mischief. The ill gotten gains. Is that a magic word, so sir? No, it's an old wa old word from a different time. Back when I was a muggle, Harry. A wee little muggle. Absolutely unhinged, sir. So that's what they need for a Hogwarts game, right? Where you can just commit atrocities. Like, you go to school there, right? But then you decide to join the Death Eaters or something. And then you go out just, like, murdering all the students. With your, like, dark magic and stuff, you know? And that'd be just badass. They got a mod for that, technically, for uh, Hogwarts Legacy, the PC. But there's only so much they can do with it, I think, with the modding. And, of course, if you get killed, you sent to Azkaban. It's kind of the end of whatever. But I mean, for some reason, you can aggro the, uh, the peaceful, like, peaceful NPCs. And they'll attack you and stuff, and they're very powerful. That's a weird thing. I don't know if that was modded in or if that's something that was programmed in the game already, but, like, there's no way to really, like, aggro them because you can't attack anything, any students or whatever. Unless maybe there was a way to do it, and it's, like, a glitchy way of doing it. I have yet to complete the game. Like, I've put it on the pause for over a year. I'm sorry for those who are, like, watching the videos and stuff, and it just, like, abruptly ended. I'm going to get around to finishing it, <laughs> as well as the Elden Ring DLC, things like that. Like, like I'm very, like, very at the end of the DLC for Elden Ring. I just took a break from it, because it's like, I keep getting my ass handed to. Oh, does that mean, like, maybe this should be an easy mode? Is that what you're trying to say? No, I'm just... I have to adapt. <laughs> I'm a little burnt out adapting. <laughs> it's a rewarding experience. Now, technically, when I first played Elden Ring and beat the boss, the final boss the first time, it was just so happened to glitch at some point to where it wasn't moving at the second phase, and I killed him. No, that was not intentional. It wasn't like, you know, like the, um, oh shit. Oh goodness, you see that? That was close. It wasn't like, um, oh, what is he called? 
It wasn't like, um... What was that guy's name from, like... The first raid in Destiny 1. Atheon? Is that right, Atheon? That sounds about right, right? Atheon. That's been such a long fucking time ago. That's a name I haven't heard for a long time. A long time, Harry. Let's see. Is that the... It's gotta be the name, right? Atheon? That sounds right. Yeah, Destiny. And then I guess they brought it back in Destiny 2. The raid stuff with that. A classic. Nah, anyways, back then, like, I was doing it legitly, right? But then later on, people were finding ways to cheese it. And not many people were, were warlocks, because at the time, you had to be a warlock in order to cheese it. So, here I am, a warlock, the most wanted damn thing to try to, like, cheese this whole system. I'm getting, like, invites, like, left and right. So I did it, and then it's like I kept doing it for a while, too, despite, like, already, like, getting my clear in for the week for completing it. I ended up getting, like, I don't know how many Mythic Classes. <laughs> One time I did a Newish raid, and it was, like, the, uh... Oh, what was it? The, um... The Forsaken one? And I think it was my first or second try or something like that. I got, like, the really rare weapon or something. And I was with a group or something like that, too. And it was, they were, like, the person head of the group was, like, super jealous about that. Same thing, too, when I kept getting, like, these, like, pieces, I guess you call them. They were, like, pieces needed to get the thorn weapon fuse when you're doing the uh the gambit stuff and i had like so many i think so many of those pieces or something like that was it pieces of those or something else no no i think i got the gambit pieces I, I don't know if you get more than one or not maybe you could i can't remember but anyways i got those and i kept getting ship parts it was another thing like i kept getting <laughs> the special ships but the funny, the fucked up funny thing about it was, like, at the time, uh, there was a lot of problems with getting ship drops and whatever else. Like, it was almost practically impossible to get, but I kept fucking getting them for some reason. Especially the special Gambit boss. This orb thing I seen, like, several times. And that's the one, too, that, like, Bungie had to go in there and patch it up to make it much more common because it was so rare to feign, but then I kept feign the damn thing. <laughs> Just shit like that. The same guy that uh, was jealous about what I got from the Forsaken thing was also jealous about all these different ship parts and stuff I got from the Gambit and keep getting the eyeball thing. That was needed to get like the thorn piece or whatever. Like, I wasn't doing shit for specials or something. I just played the shit out of it. Because it was fun. It was different. It's like playing, like, Firefight on it, you know, with Halo. Well, yeah, it would probably be similar because it's the same company that made Halo, duh. Oh, you know what I mean. It, it had its roots, is what I was trying to say. Its roots. Listen here, son boy. And then by the time the Vex raid came out for Destiny 2, like, I, I, you know, I was with a group of people. This was the first day and stuff like that. We were trying to grind it and grind it, and then, like, people were just, like, fighting, getting kicked and everything else, and then... I just kind of quietly dipped out, turned off my system and everything. 
and like it was just too much and then that was the last time i've ever played and that would have been like i don't know 2018 2019 or something like that that was the last day i think that's the last time i played like something kind of switched in my head it's like this is uh this is just too much I mean, I just never went back. I could have went back and be like, all right, let's do this. But I just never really did. I didn't have the impulse to go back anymore. And then looking back now, it's like, you know, I mean, maybe it was a good I stopped. Because there's so many DLCs <laughs> right now. I think they did the last one because they didn't do so high with the cells. I think that was the last last of it. And they're probably doing like some specials or something now, but not as much as the DLC stuff. It's probably in the last final days. I didn't even do like the last DLC for Destiny 1, truth be told. I was in a weird position in life where, you know, I had things to do and whatever else, you know, and I, I didn't really seek to going back in the game. It's another, that was like another time that was going on too with that. It's weird enough. Like I stopped playing, but for different reasons, but then it didn't lure me back to go back into it. And I had to look to see what exactly was happening because people were telling me about the raids with it and stuff. The last raid, the last whatever kind of stuff, and it was some kind of like different entity form or something, Vex again, or something like that. I don't know what it was exactly, but it was. I was told it was like super hard raid. And the BS about it, I guess. $12.99! Look, as slow as $12.99 a month. Plus shipping and handling. And I'm like casually playing this game. Bad PhD. Uh, I don't think I need that. Casually playing this game we got so far already. We're already like on this floor. Not quite quick enough for boss rush, but that's fine. Pretty close. Someone's playing Warhammer 40,000K or whatever. Space Marine 2. I've never played any of those games. I have nothing against them. It's just I don't know much of them, you know? I, I've heard them over the years. I've seen little bits and tidbits and stuff with it. I wasn't sure if it's like some weird strategy game or something. Which I'm not really much into strategy. Strats. Ah. No gupsters yet. Range up that's pointless for brimstone. Unless we reroll and get some other thing. I might rearrange my stats anyways. But I am... Not gonna reroll. This is like too good to be given up here. Unless we use this like a Hail Mary, we like almost die or something. Kuai Wick Chain, we'll take this instead. Kuai Wick Chain. Now that is a name I have not heard of in a long time. Over 20 years, let's just say. That's the crazy thing about time. Is like... How things that didn't seem so long ago was so long ago. Huge growth, I guess we'll hold on to here in case like some sinister thing happens. Put her foot down, chain her to hell and back. Oh boy. 
That was so useful. Um, sure. You gotta take this. Conjoined. Look at this. Now we got double the brimstone. Which, well, I don't know, six teplin or whatever you call it. The brimstone, technically. Triple times triple. That's not right. Triple times two. There we go. See, now you know math. You son of a gun. Oh, I got brimstone bombs too. Did I like pick those up? No, I must have rerolled them. That's right. I, I that's part of the reroll. I'm gonna say, when did I pick those up? I don't remember shit about it. I got so much freaking power. Come on, we chain. Nope, it does not work when they're on the ground. It's like trying to use Surf while the Diglett's on the ground, trying to use the Dick Attack. You missed. You missed the Tsunami Wave. Oh, Godness. Careful. Careful, you honorary son of a gun. Wow, that looks like a dead end or what? I think this is a dead end, too. Yep. 10 points of Gryffindor for being right, but then also wrong because you went the wrong way anyways, despite knowing this knowledge. You so dearly hold to your heart's content. These curse rooms are kind of scary too at times because I don't know what's going to come out and bite me in the ass. I'm just assuming I'm going to be careful. We haven't found much of a challenge yet for things coming at us. Oh, except that maybe. Okay, we're fine. Oh, yeah. Goodbye. I know it's one key piece, but it's forever. Wait until the war. Oh! I didn't die. I thought I was, I was just like gonna just give in and be like, all right, I'm gonna accept my fate. Cause I got a hit there at one time and then it's like, I thought it'd be like enough of a thing that's gonna hit me. There's been plenty of time to lose my, uh, whatever. Like my cooldown for my invincibility. And apparently not. We've been blessed. Took his minion with him. This chain is so useful. And I don't even pick up this chain much. Kuai with chain. The greatest ever. Puberty, we're now adult. We could do adult things now, and that incredible. All right, we gotta be careful. One thing at a time. All right. Oh, you know what? There was that lost daily I had that I lost. Yeah, <laughs> ironically enough, a few days ago, when I was uh, trying to escape out of the curse room on this very kind of floor, on the womb floors, and I kept fucking around. I got like hit early out the door, and I didn't get out quick enough before like. the uh, invincibility thing went away. That was on me with that. That was a huge fuck up. But now we're making it up right now. Uh, at least for right now. The run hasn't hasn't been concluded yet, so I can't just say. While I'm not there yet, you know. 
I can't be like, oh, this is conclusive. I am the greatest. What we got here? I don't need that. Ah, it's probably a, oh yeah, it's why I popped the pill, didn't I? I might as well just like pop in the boss fight here. She had a hell of a whiplash. Hilarious game, giving me in the, the very last like thing. I go go. Well, do I want to go the freaking? That, I mean, it's spooky as fuck. Hilarious. I remember when that was like a glitch. You're not supposed to like do it on the, on the uh, hush floor. Otherwise like you're soft locked. I remember those days. We'll take this with us. Ah. Yeah, I know it reduces my brimstone range substantially, but it's cool, okay? Shot speed up. Ah, that actually that might influence it. Guess that range up did something, huh? All right. This is spooky. Uh, careful with the whip line. Oh, I gotta pop this. This is spooky, man. I, maybe I should not picked up the uh, eyeball tears. Using the chain on against Mog, which I've never used on the guy. Well, no, I, I let me rephrase. I used on the guy, but I didn't effectively use it to the point that I was able to kill him with it. You know, with that ability in Elden Ring. This chain is so fucking useful right now. Okay, could you just fucking get up, you fat coward? Alright. That was spooky. But it's been done! I have survived! That's what matters the most! Alright, we're going up. I'm out of tea. That's fine. I gotta finish eating tonight. I'm actually feeling a little better. I don't know, I took my vitamins and ate some food and some vitamins and stuff, so I feel like it did something, honestly. Forever. I feel like it improved things. Well, who would have thunk it? A luck foot, okay. $14.99 plus shipping and handling. Oh shit. Forgot my credit card. <laughs> oh shit. Now I'll never see it again. Ah, good for the next floor. All right. It's been actually a very quick run. We're like 30 minutes in. 
Luck up, man. Like, we don't really have, like, much for tier effects for this, but... If we do get something, that'd be pretty sweet. Let's just pop this now. Delay the inevitable. All right, watch out. He can whip back and fucking get you. You stand in the middle there. I got the punch. I, I just realized I got the pun punching tears. And he just got punched out. He got knocked the fuck out. Good. Oh, it's the fucking boys trying to start their little mischief games again. Trying to look for, like, those secret rooms, because we've got the pill effect going on here. Shot speed, you know, that should help us with these eyeball tears, in theory. All right. Well, we technically milked this floor. Unless there could be a curse room. Uh, let's see. Maybe could be up here. Oh, there is a curse room. We got to check it, you know, because it could be like Guppy or something. Or just a bunch of dirty, fat, rotten spiders. All right. We're out of here. Actually, you know what? Before we go, let's see if there's a red chest. Um, well, it's not a red chest, but I'll just, I'll do it anyways. Okay. It's that item again. We meet again. Oh, what the hell? We are two for one special. I don't need it, but I appreciate it. All right, last floor here. I don't know how dense cap works. It just angles the tears differently, okay. I thought it'd be giving me more Different kind of firepower. This is a little fucking spooky as shit now. Now I gotta angle my shots. Pussy! Never have I heard him being excited for pussy in my entire life. Alright, we're fine. What are we worried about? What are we worried about? Oh, yeah, that thing. That's what I'm worried about. Really? Now we got the item. Wouldn't that be just hilarious? Hey, there's a chance, but it's pretty low. Freaking. Annihilated, decimated. Who'd have thought? If we didn't have that poster, we would have lost that run and had to start another Eden. Start another Eden run. I'll take the fly. Oh no, I got hit. All right. Cooking the books here. Shot speed and more speed. I am so speedy, I can hardly sit still. The Banes, Banes. I'm surprised I didn't get hit.
ghostly dude. Now we got the ghosty besties in the house. Watch out, he's gonna whip back. No, he does not. All right, let's backtrack here. Just look around a little bit. So you never know if we get like the mega sitting key. We don't have the get, get out of jail free card unlocked yet. So that's out of the question. Oh, look at that. We got so many pals. Everybody's here. Oh, this bullshit. That's like the worst thing for this guy right now. Next to fanny pack. I don't even know what's worse, honestly. I, I guess at least with fanny pack, it's like, or at least with this item, you're gonna get a stat if you die. Only for this floor, of course, but then on the other hand, fanny pack, you have a chance to like get an item if you die. But then it's like permanent, you can keep it if you do drop it, so. Fanny pack wins for the lost. Anyways, two wins in a row. Look at that. Thanks for watching. Like it, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time.